You stop it. You stop it. Are we gonna try and clean up your toys today? This is a little bit. It's getting a little out of hand. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, welcome. My name is Alyssa. I'm a 25 year old first time mom and my son Reese is nine months old. You'll kind of hear him in the background. But today we are going to be working on playroom organization. Now we have a living room playroom combo. It's a shared space. So I need one that looks cute and can still serve as an adult space, but is also functional for Reese to be able to get to his toys and have space to play. My playroom honestly is a disaster right now. I don't have any sort of organization really in place. So I'm just gonna show you what my living room looks like currently. So this is current currently what my living room looks like. Here's the guilty one himself. We honestly have a lot of decent sized pieces of kid furniture in here as well as a huge sectional couch. So just trying to get everything to work is just really gonna take some creativity and thought process on how to organize it. Reese, you're gonna dump all those out, aren't you? Okay. But layout wise, typically this little white table and these two little chairs sit in this corner. Um, Reese obviously is a little bit small to kind of just be sitting at this table, but he does enjoy knocking and climbing over the chairs. Fun fact, it's actually my childhood table from our cottage in Vermont. My uncle brought it down to give to Reese for him to use. And then I did recently upgrade our TV stand. I did get one that has doors that can close and two shelves. I got this from Amazon and it's not the best quality but it's definitely okay. I just like the cane front on it. I'll link that below for you if you'd like. We got his pickler and his ramp that he got from Christmas that usually sits here. And then over here is kind of just like shelves mixed with bookshelves and obviously toys everywhere. I did also get a toy chest thinking that that would help with the toy issues, but you open it up and there's just like random toys in here, no sort of order and it's just not helpful. As you can tell, our Skip Hop Activity Center is doubling as our coffee table. I sold my coffee table on Facebook Marketplace and so this is kind of just working for us for the meantime. Reese has kind of outgrown it. He doesn't enjoy sitting in it anymore. He does like walking along the edge of it and playing with the toys. But I think we'll just kind of have to deal with not having a coffee table because this needs to go because he's just too big for it now. So I ended up discovering that you can use mesh bags, like drawstring bags. I ordered like a 20 pack off of Amazon. I'm hoping that I can put like all the squishy balls in here and then be able to put them inside of his chest. It'll work where I will be able to just pull a bag out and put it in rotation and everything will kind of have a home and a place. So that's the goal. So first things first, I'm going to go ahead and try and clean everything up and separate into different groups. You got some chapped cheeks, buddy. Mountain Laurel high fives, miles in spring. Rainbow trout, hummingbird wing. Golden, I'll follow you. So this is what we're currently working with. I have all the toys right here. I got rid of the Jolly Jumper. I got rid of the rocking chair right there. That's gonna go up into his nursery. And then right here, I got rid of the activity center. So let's go ahead and organize these toys.
Okay, so this is what we're working with. I feel like it doesn't look any better probably, but I swear there's a method to my madness. So I've kind of just divided everything into like little categories and so then I can kind of comb through what I'm keeping, what I'm not, and what I'm storing. This pal, for example, is like decorative baskets and all of like his super baby toys that he doesn't need down here anymore. We have blocks, balls, little figurines, music throw stuff, books that need to go upstairs, different little categories. So now I'm gonna go ahead and just bag up each of the ones that are either gonna go in here or line them up on the shelf for his play. You're my best friend. Didn't care about the rules, good on the weekends. I'll be in fools, just in the deep space. <laughs> so brave and so stupid, just like the movies. How it's going no, no. in the fight with you. Just thinking we would do this until we couldn't do it. Each and every high, every night with you. You and me so clueless. We were just broken, shattered, singing along to nothing matters. So now we got the big ones there, and then I have each individual little one in a mesh bag. So this is what we're now working with. Seems much more organized. And then inside here, we have all the toys and little bags and then like some of the bigger toys over here. So now looking at the space, I think I want to rearrange where I want the chest to go where the table is. I think that's what my first step is gonna be. And then I think I wanna move the bookshelf as well. Do you like it over here better, Bubba? Okay, so now we're working with Pickler over here. The chest is over here. Now the table. See, the table is my problem. Dakota thinks it should go in the dining room. What if we put it right there? I'll take you anywhere you want. As long as we're together, everything we do, you got me going on. So now we have this here, the table's right here, the pickler. Do we like the table here? Ugh. Whoa, careful buddy. I'm not sure, I'm not sure how I feel about it. Like it looks kind of awkward there, doesn't it? Maybe I'll put this in the dining room because I really do like the bookshelf there. I think it looks cute. What do you think, Reese? Your beloved chair is not gonna be in here anymore though. You're a ham. Stop fake coughing, you silly. So I think this might be the, the vibe right now to keep the extra space in the living room, but I can always easily, I feel like, move this and then I'll just move the high chair into the corner over there. OK, 
Okay, so here's the final result. So we have like our playmat here, and then I have all of his shelves. I moved his pickler right here, his bookshelf, extra storage if we need it. If anybody knows any good like storage solutions for stuffed animals, please let me know.